Hi there again booktube, welcome back to my channel, Lola here and this is my June book haul. I bought a few books this month, not a huge amount but I'm trying not to buy loads anyway so yeah let's get straight into this. Yeah as you know I'm I'm finishing off buying the series that I've already started so the, these are all sequels or something. Um, the first book I'm going to show you is The Beating of Wings or The Beating of His Wings and this is by Paul Hoffman. This is the third book in the um, Left Hand of God series. Or this series is a trilogy and something about God and people who follow God or go against God. So this is something I really want to read. It's fantasy slash with religion so hopefully I will get around to that series at some point but it does look really good. The next book I bought is another Mark Lawrence book and this is The Liar's Key. It's the second book in the Red Queen War series and I really look forward to reading these now that I've finished the Broken Empire series. Um, Mark Lawrence is a wonderful writer who writes in the perspective of unlikable characters and that's what he's famous for and I really can't wait to read it because it looks fantastic. It's a lot smaller than I thought it'd be when it came but I'll get there eventually. Um, it's very small writing so it might take a while for me to read but I'll jump in there soon hopefully. So The next two books I bought this month were The Half World by Joe Abercrombie and Half A War by Joe Abercrombie. These are book two and three in the Half, I don't know, trilogy? Uh, but yeah, there's, I think it's a trilogy and I look forward to reading them because they are um, they are fantasy series so I can't wait to read these. George R. R. Martin has, has written something on the back of this book as, as um, talks about it. It says, he says, grabbed me and refused to let go. Um, so if George R. R. Mar George R. R. Martin likes it then why not me? I will love something like this because it's about... The first one's called Half a King, so I'm assuming that's about somebody taking over a kingdom and all that kind of thing and his journey on to doing that. And then Half a World would be taking over maybe parts of the world, I don't know, and then Half a War would obviously be a book on war, so I look forward to reading these. Um, and the last book I bought this month was Ice Like Fire, which is the second book to Snow Like Ashes uh, by Sarah Raj. Raj? But this seems fantastic because it's um, the first book I know is um, a girl who goes to Scotland and goes through some kind of portal into the past or something. I know that sounds like Outlander but it's not. <laughs> um, or she goes into some kind of portal into another world. But it's a very Scottishy type fantasy book so I can't wait to read that and see how, how that plans out and how, to, how that turns out eventually. So um, I've got a lot of series to read as you may see, so uh, my TBR pile isn't getting bigger, it's just getting the series done this year, so I'll, I'll jump right into my next books anyway that I've got planned. Just so you know, I'm not doing TBRs anymore. I've decided against that because it's forcing me to read books that I might not want to read at the time. I, I really just want to walk up to my bookshelf and choose something for myself and then I'll give you wrap up videos and reviews and all that kind of thing and it'll surprise you on what I've read as well, it, you know, you won't know I've read until the end of the month or until I've done the review, so aha, surprise is coming guys. But obviously I'm going to be reading um, the last Harry Potter book this month, Deathly Hallows. I'm also going to be reading the fourth book in the Rick Road and Percy Jackson series. I'll be reading Battle of the Lab Labyrinth by um, Rick Road. And they're the only books I know that I'm going to read. So I'll surprise myself and I'll surprise you. So I really, really hope you liked my, my book purchases of the month and I will see you in my next video. Bye bye!